So we're on past Steck's stand here uh, at um, Still Fab 2020. I'm with Zahid. Zahid, um, tell me a little bit about this Puma SMX 3100, some machine. Yeah, well, uh, actually we call it Puma SMX3. This is a super multitasking machine, we call it. It's a, uh, it's a, a very good seller from Doosan, and uh, they come up with a, uh, very nice solutions on this kind of machine. You know, it's a, it's a twin spindle, uh, full five axis machine. Well, this option is seven axis machine, and we've got uh, nine axis on this kind of machine in different options. So, so your market here in the Middle East, is this the type of machine that is selected commonly and this multitasking one hit style? Yeah, well, actually, uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a kind of a requirement of uh, nowadays, you know, especially in the aerospace industries, in defense industries, and uh, in uh, in uh, some uh, uh, some uh, military sectors also. So uh, I mean, yeah. Is, is there anything that this machine can't do when it comes to challenging parts? Like, you know, w we know that the the uh, difficult materials, Hastelloy's, Inconels. Is this does does this machine fit into those areas? Yes, this machine definitely fits into those areas. Uh, this machine actually is designed for the high speed machinings, and uh, especially machining of Inconels and. Uh, uh, high-speed aerospace alloys, something like that. Yeah. What's the capabilities of that head? Because okay, I can I can sense that we've got a lot of power in in both the spindles yes. here, but but what about what we've got on the milling side? Yeah, well, this uh, uh, this machine is uh, with 12,000 rpm, and uh, we have a C6 head, and uh, it's a Capto 6 head, and you got uh, HSK spindle on this machine also, and it's a very high torque spindle. Uh, where, where would I be loading the tools, Zahid? I'm just trying to look here. Where would I load the tools for the milling? Well, this is the uh, this is that uh, the tool magazine for this one. Well, this machine will, has got 80 tool magazine in this one, so it's gonna it's gonna uh, take the tools from this magazine, and uh, it will be directly loading the, the tools from here. And this is you see this one, it will be loading the tools from this side. Okay, so from a, from a manual handling point of view, I don't I, I can I can stay at the front you of the still, machine. Yeah. yeah, yeah, you can you can still uh, uh, load the machine. Some options on this machine is having the the camera inside the ATC, right? So you can operate operate this. Uh, uh, this uh, ATC panel very easily, and uh, you can you can change the tools, or you can operator can easily uh, maneuver the tools. And is it expandable? Can I go for more tools if I want yeah, them? Because yeah. of course, uh, you can. Uh, the minimum in this one is 40, then 60, then 80, then 120 tools is possible. Okay, now, now, finally, tell me about this sub spindle here. Yeah. Um, when, when, when we're looking at this, Sahid, it's important on a multitasking machine to be able to um, do as much on the back spindle as you can on the front. Does does it have a, a, you know equal performance on that secondary spindle? Uh, actually, the main spindle is the more powerful spindle. Then you have uh, the secondary spindle, which actually used for the part transfer. And uh, uh, it has a, it has a, uh, the main spindle is more capable to do the things. And I, I know I keep saying final point, but what about when it comes to accuracy and reliability? The Doosan brand um, yeah. for yourselves here in the Middle East, that must be a big factor when you're selling. Yeah. And 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 do you do you achieve those those things? The longevity, yeah, definitely accuracy. Uh, uh, Doosan has worked a lot in the accuracies. I mean, this machine comes with the uh, with the linear scales as well. So accuracy, definitely, they have. Uh, uh, it's an X and Y linear scale, so I mean it's a, it's uh, what, a great what, machine. What's your role here at Past Tech, Zahid? What do you do? Uh, yeah, uh, I'm actually the uh, sales manager for uh, Saudi Arabia, and uh, I am I, uh, handling the Saudi Arabian sales. Uh, so this is our head office uh, in Past Tech Sharjah. And how many machines will you put into Saudi Arabia in a year? I mean, uh, Saudi Arabia, we have uh, quite a lot of machines, and uh, we'll say that uh, roughly uh, uh, many machines in oil and gas sectors. And uh, general engineering sectors, we put machines. So is it a busy market at the moment? Yeah, at the moment, yeah, yeah. yeah. Even in uh, in Dubai also, and in uh, all over the Middle East, the market is growing. And especially for this kind of machines, people are are uh, looking forward to have uh, uh, the specialized machine. They are uh, they, they they want to invest on the, the non-conventional machines, which is normal two axis, three axis machines. People want to go to the technology. So that's stuff. this kind of machines. Great stuff. Thank you, Zahid. Very interesting to hear not just about the technology that's on show here from Doosan, but where it fits around the Middle East. Obviously, Zahid saying himself that he's from Saudi Arabia. Uh, there's markets all over the world for multitasking technology, which is uh, exactly what this Puma machine, this SMX, this 3100 is capable of doing. Thank you very much, Zahid. Thank you very much. Cheers.